think to start with, it's important uh, that uh, we apologize to our supporters um, who came all the way from Manchester here to Brighton. Yeah, we were just not good enough from start to finish. The performance was uh, uh, not only poor, it was extremely poor. Um, we knew that even from our first game that we played at home in the first half that Brighton is uh, a very flexible technical team, always trying to play through, through your lines and to be creative. So we knew that it was not enough to just enjoy yourself in possession of the ball. The problem was we were not that often in possession of the ball. In order to be in possession, we, would, we should have won the ball. But we gave them far too much space and time. And uh, at halftime, if we're honest, uh, the only good thing was the result for us. It was only 1-0. So at halftime, for me, the question was, what are we going to do? Um, bring on two new players, that was clear. But do we change the formation into a 3-5-2 or do we take the risk to play in a 4-4-2, which we did in the end? Um, in hindsight, maybe that was a little bit too much of a risk. I mean, you can answer that question yourself. It was a humiliating defeat today and uh, even more so for a team like Manchester United. I think that was the second highest defeat in my whole career as a, as a coach in the last 35 years. But it's not only that you lose 4-0, it was also the way that we played. And this is just unacceptable, very difficult to deal with and to cope.